everyone, my name is Pixie333 and today in this video I'm going to be doing three beauty makeup packs, I guess you could say, that um, I'm going to be showing you guys today. Um, if you don't know why I'm doing these videos, um, there's going to be a video up every single week, Monday to Sunday even, so yeah, make sure you check out all the videos and make sure you subscribe up there so you can not miss any um but yeah you might notice i haven't got any lipstick on i haven't got any eye makeup on so yeah um i'm oh and i've not done up my brows so i'm going to be teaching you a hack about um how to make a different color lipstick but i'm going to start with the brows now if you watched my weekend makeup routine or daily makeup routine i can't remember i'll link it in the description below my last makeup tutorial um i actually showed you guys how i do my eyebrows because i don't fill in my eyebrows um but i do brush them through and here is a little tip that i come up with on how you can do your eyebrows so yeah i have a little mirror here because usually i use the really big mirror but the big mirror i have i've just put down and you're sat on top of it right now so usually usually you're here and I'm looking this way but this time I got a little mirror and you're here and I'm gonna be like this doing my makeup so you'll get to see me from the front instead of half my face so my tip is get a old mascara now this mascara I've had for years and it ran out in years and years and years ago so sorry if you heard that car beat but this is a pink one don't know what it is where it's from or anything but you can either wash them out or not but I would make sure that there's no nothing in it at all and all you do is brush through your eyebrows like so and it just basically um, lets you shape them however you want which is just really cool and fun and um, if one is slightly thinner than the other you can make it how you like basically okay so the next hack is i'm gonna do my eyes and this hack teaches you um an easier way to put on eyeshadow so i'm going to be putting on eyeliner and mascara as well but that isn't that's just i'm just going to do that regularly but what i am going to do is put apply a base that um, makes your eyeshadow more pigmented um, if you mess up you can just wipe it away and I will demonstrate that for you and also it stays on longer and um, there's no way of me showing you how long it stays on currently but usually the eye makeup that I'm going to put on I'm also doing a smoky eye the eye makeup I would usually put on will last for about 7 hours this would last you 24 hours if you wanted to so yeah um but what you're gonna do is you're gonna add this is the maybelline new york a new baby skin so you're gonna grab a bit it's all clear so you're gonna grab a bit look i need i'm running out i need more i can't live without this stuff i use it every time i put on makeup on so you grab a bit if you can see that and you're just gonna put it oh, let me get my mirror so i can see um i put a bit too much on one finger so i'm just going to show that even in between the two eyes that i have and you're going to mas massage that into your lid okay so now you have massaged that into your eyelid you can see you can't really tell that there's anything on my eyes um someone's talking outside i don't think we'll take that one there and um, but now, what you can do before it dries is you're going to add your eyeshadow. So I'm going to be doing a smoky eye, as I said. Um, so I just have eyeshadow brush, and I'll really quickly speed through me doing a smoky eye. So yeah, I'll get back to you guys when I've finished the smoky eye. Let me get my Did you guys see that? Okay, if you didn't, basically... I went a bit out of line with my dark eyeshadow 
and I just wipe that away. So say you got some white shadow and you put it in the wrong place, like that is the wrong place, get your finger, rub it away, and it's done. And not much access comes out on your finger at all, hardly any actually. So yeah, that is one of the things, and you can see it's coming out so pretty to the moment um, than it usually was, and over time it will dry. So yeah. I'm just using two colours for my smoky, I'm using white and black. Um, because, okay. And now, I'm one of those people that when they put on makeup, it looks really, really scruffy. But then, um, I'm really messy, but then at the end, it looks okay. It actually looks decent. Okay, so now I have my smoky eye on, I'm going to add my mascara and eyeliner. So yeah, let me do that. And then it's so annoying to put on. hate to put on. It's something you I've just noticed, usually I'm talking all the time when I do my makeup, but just right then I'm so quiet. But I'm just really like eyeliner, and whenever I'm putting on any makeup, I'm just like, I've got such a face on. Okay, so now my eyes are done, and that is the second hack done. I'm on the third hack now, and this is for my lips. Now, this was the second one I made up, and I tested it, and it works amazingly. So, all you need is two lipsticks. You need one lipstick that might be a bit too strong, or you want a certain colour so like in the scenario that I made this before I got my baby pink lipstick I have now I wanted to wear a baby pink lip because I thought it went with the certain eyeshadow I had on that day really really well and the only sort of good pink that I had was this hot pink and that isn't baby pink that's hot pink so I was like okay I need to make this lighter so I got the hot cocoa from Baby Lips, which was limited edition in Christmas. If you didn't get it, you can use any light lipstick. Um, and it looks like this, and it's just basically a nude lipstick. And I was like, what if I mix these together? The good thing to do is to put this on your top lip, and this on your bottom lip and when you rub your lips together it makes a nice baby pink it doesn't stay on for as long as a regular lipstick would I'm gonna pop the hot pink I don't know what brand this is like I've had it for so long the packaging's just faded away so I'm gonna pop this on the top lip Okay. 
And then I'm gonna put the Hot Cocoa Baby Lips from Maybelline New York on my bottom lip. Okay, and you look really, really weird right now. You will look really, really weird if you do this. But now I'm gonna rub it together and show you the difference. There you go. Do you notice it is a few shades lighter than this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then depending how much of this you put on, depends how light it will get. So yeah, and you can do that with reds, you can do that with purples, you can do that with any lipstick you have. So anyway guys, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did like and subscribe. Um, in the description of the Monday to Sunday videos, um, there will be the Monday video, the Tuesday video, the Wednesday video, Thursday video, Friday video, Saturday video and Sunday video as soon as they're all online. So if you're watching this on Friday, um, then you have a few more to catch up on. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, everyone. Please give it a thumbs up if you did like and subscribe. I think I've already said that, but oh well. Um, yeah, I'll see you next time.